Hello and welcome to a um, series of videos looking at drawing graphs. Um, let's get started with this. Um, the first graph that we asked to draw is the graph y equals 3x plus 2. Now um, also we've given, been given this table. Uh, this table is going to help us to draw the graph of y equals 3x plus 2. Um, if you're not given a table what I suggest that you do is you draw up a table um, for, your, uh, for yourself. Um, it just helps with um, plotting these graphs. Now, um, the first thing um, that we need to remember is that all that we're doing with these numbers along the top is um, substituting them into the equation. Now, what does this equation mean? What it is saying is that the um, value for y is equal to 3 times by the value for x add on 2. So what we could say is really all that we are going to be doing with each of these x values is simply times in by 3 and adding on 2. So let's take a look at the first one. 0 multiplied by 3 add on 2 gives us 2. 1 multiplied by 3 add on 2 gives us 5. 2 multiplied by 3 add on 2 gives us 8. Now um, what we should now spot is that we've got a pattern. We can see here that we are going up by 3 each time. Now you may have been wondering why I um, why did I begin with 0? Why didn't I start with minus 2? Now the reason that I didn't start with minus 2 is simply because working with negative numbers it's easy to make um, a small mistake. So if we start with our positive numbers first we'll see a pattern has formed um, and so we just need to extend that pattern. If we're going up by 3 each time, this number here is going to be 3 less than the number that comes in front of it. So my, uh, my number that was going to go in here is simply going to be minus 1. And the number in here is going to be minus 4. Now we can check if that makes sense um, by substituting this in. If I do 3 times by minus 2, that gives me um, minus 6. Then add on 2 gives me minus 4. So that is definitely correct. Okay, now what um, these values give us? Um, these values give us coordinates. Um, so if I just um, get rid of this a second, let's write up what these coordinates are. So what we are saying is that our coordinates here are minus 2, minus 4. Our x coordinate is minus 2, our y coordinate is minus 4. Next one is minus 1, minus 1. The next one, 0, 2. The next one, 1, 5. And then the last one, 2, 8. So we've got ourselves 5 coordinates now. Um, all that I need to do now is simply plot these onto my graph. So the first one is minus 2, minus 4. That's all the way down the bottom here. Um, remember that when I'm reading these, um, when I'm plotting these coordinates, that I go along the corridor first, so along the x-axis, and then up or down the stairs after that. Um, so the next one, along the corridor to minus 1, and then down the stairs to minus 1. And that gives me a coordinate there. Uh, next one go along the corridor to 0 then up the stairs to 2 and so my next coordinate is going to be there um, next one go along the corridor to where 1 is then I'm going up to 5 that gives me uh, my fourth coordinate and then the last one go along the corridor to 2 and up the stairs to 8 and this gives me um, the points that I need to plot now I just need to do one more thing um, to finish this off and it's something that people tend um, to forget about um, and that is to draw the um, the line on um, to draw the line onto your grid so when you have plotted the point simply get a ruler and plot um, plot the graph through the points that you've just drawn now when you've got um, when you've got a graph 
in this format y equals 3x plus 2 so notice that there are no it's not x squared or anything like that what we end up with is we get a straight line if we don't get a straight line you'll have done one of two things wrong you may have either um, calculated your coordinates incorrectly so wrong coordinates or the other mistake you may have made is that you've plotted your coordinates in the wrong uh, position so the, the other mistake that you might make is you've plotted coordinates incorrectly so for example um, going up or down the stairs before you go along the corridor for example so um, this one here if I plotted this incorrectly I'd be saying that it um, would be minus 4 on the x-axis and then minus 2 on the y and that wouldn't be um, quite right so that's the other potential mistake um, you may have made if you don't get a straight line when you've got um, a graph in that format